NVIDIA. So what was that all about? Let's put it all into perspective. Last night, we had some news come out from Bloomberg saying that NVIDIA uh, had a subpoena. However, the reality was it was for many chip companies. They just want further information. No surprise that came down after a day of selling off from Wall Street just before the jolts report, which I also said would be good. And it was, and it is, and the stocks are coming straight back up again. Some of you will say this is uh, what it is. It's manipulation. It's Wall Street. It's the Department of Justice. Justice, my backside. It was just a load of busybodies poking around in nothing. It wasn't even new news. I saw many YouTubers making stories about this is big news and blah, blah, blah. Well, the fact of the matter is this story has been going on since January. Uh, it's not new. However, it was presented at the end of a huge rally just to drive it down, just take it back up again. Does that mean that everyone is out to get you? Does it mean that uh, it's all about uh, a conspiracy? Wall Street are just trying to take from the little man. No, it's not. No one's your enemy. No one's trying to drive it down. What they're trying to do is do what they do for themselves because people aren't interested. Wall Street aren't interested in stuffing it to the little man. It sells videos, though. People like to feel it's the little man on Robin Hood versus Wall Street. No, it didn't. The big man doesn't care. When I speak to Wall Street, I speak to CEOs, hedge fund managers, people that are in the know. They don't care or even think. Nothing personal about retail traders. David Hensley donated $5 through a super chat. Here's another $5. Make your drinks bigger. I don't know the sizes at Starbucks. Smiley face. Thank you. I'll go for Vente. Thank you very much. This is being made during a live, uh, a live show. So yesterday, all this happened just before the Jolts report. It's not a conspiracy, but it is the rich and powerful trading. Now remember, you're trading doing exactly the same thing. The difference is you have no power to do anything about it. And when you trade... No one even blinks or notices. The markets don't drop. They don't go up. Nothing happens. But it does happen when the whales dump it. So it's not a conspiracy. Nothing's bad happening to NVIDIA. Nothing is going to happen bad to NVIDIA because it's a great business. The Department of Justice isn't going to reveal any magic, isn't going to take them down, isn't going to destroy the AI business, isn't going to destroy the market. All that happened is some of you got marching called. Some of you sold out for a loss, and now everyone's buying it back up again. What did I do? Nothing. I was already in when, when uh, this was all down in the 80s. Makes no difference to me whatsoever. I'm all in margin, but only with the S&P. It's all about knowing what you own, knowing how this system works, and letting it all just play out. Lots of noise all over YouTube, people talking nonsense. So I just thought I would update you with everything is now fine again. Well, if it was really bad for NVIDIA and the DOJ was going to jump all over it and they were going to be sued and closed down and shut down and it was finished like many said it was yesterday, why is it going up? Because it went down. As <laughs> simple as that. So we've got coming up very shortly the biggest event in three years. This event here. I would like you to join me and make this NVIDIA Day, which it will be NVIDIA Day. It's this day right now, and I know it's going to be huge. I set down a huge challenge. FOMC Day with Jerome Powell is NVIDIA Day because this is the day things are going to be extremely manipulated, extremely volatile, and I'm calling it NVIDIA Day. And there are channels with millions of subscribers that I believe we can have more views than them with our just 34,000. Because when Meet Kevin did NVIDIA earnings, he had about 100,000 with 2 million subscribers. We had 38,000 subscribers with, sorry, had 38,000 views with 33 thousand subscribers. Our engagement rate is the highest of any channel on earth. 98% of our viewers are members. 
more than most channels combined. So we already have 89 likes. We had about 60 likes ahead of time for NVIDIA earnings. This, I am hoping, will be somewhere in the region of 40,000 live viewers. We had 38 for NVIDIA. 40. Why is that important? Well, it's nice for me. I'll make a couple of bucks. If I get about 40,000, I'll make about $300 for the live stream. Somewhere in that region, I guess, if I have that many. But it's not about making 300 bucks one way or another. It's about providing the real information that is true and honest and helpful, not just what will sell me videos. I'll be live. I'll be live all day. I'll be covering it. So I'm making this during a live video right now. Let me give everyone the link and let's just see if I can get a few more people to, uh, to click on it right now and I'll end this video. It's been a very hard couple of days. A lot of stressed people. There's the link in the chat for those that are watching live. Can we get one more like just to show people that I'm making this live and this is real and real engagement counts? Uh, very few channels will schedule shows out like this. Meet Kevin never does it. I'm always scheduling my shows out. So it's a commitment to the event. You know what's happening. It's just like a TV guide. Let's refresh it in five, four, three, two, one. Let's see if one more person has liked it. 92. <laughs> I love it. Imagine if we get 100 likes on a video that's two weeks away. How amazing would that be? Shall we try again? I'm pushing my luck now. Five, four, three, two, one. 93. <laughs> I'm loving it. I'm loving it. I'm not going to ask anymore because it's more than I deserve. It's absolutely bonkers. Uh, so anyway, join us for the NVIDIA day. It is NVIDIA day because NVIDIA is one of the best companies you can own, but it's also manipulated, extremely volatile, but the business itself is as solid as a rock. They're not going to be sued by the DOJ. The company isn't going to go down to $25. Someone told me that yesterday. Those of you that send me emails going, I followed you and now I've lost all my money because you over leveraged, you bought at the wrong time. Just want to be absolutely clear. If you are following me and you're doing exactly what I'm doing, which you shouldn't be doing, because I know what I know and you know what you know, which is very different. But I can assure you, if you are doing exactly what I am doing, rather than telling me I'm following you, but I'm losing my money, ask yourself why I am not losing any money. Because you're not doing exactly what I am doing. If you was, you'd be up, just like I am once again. I started with $5,000. I'm now back at nearly 111. My all-time high is 113. So I'm nearly in an all-time high. I've got no shorts. I've got no options. So if you were doing exactly what I was doing and you started with $5,000 three years ago, you'd bid 110.815. But the reality is the emails I get from people and the comments I get from people, I'm losing all my money because of you. I've lost all my money. I went all in on margin. When did I ever tell anyone to go all in on margin on any stock? Least of all, a single stock. NVIDIA Day, join us for the big event of the decade until I announce the next biggest event of the decade. It's looking pretty good though. We've got 93 likes, 24 waiting. 24 people waiting on a video that starts in a live event that starts in 14 days. Stick that in your pipe and smoke it, uh, meet Kevin. Oh, and by the way, if you missed it, 98. We're two away from 100. YouTube will suggest it at 100. They will suggest it at 100 and it doesn't go live for two weeks. This will be our best 
ever live event. I, let's go. Let's go for it. Let's beat all the channels: CNBC, the BBC, Bloomberg, everybody. Let's beat every single channel in the world. I'm loving it. Ninety-eight. Let me give everyone the link, just in case you haven't clicked on it. Let's get it suggested by YouTube two weeks in advance. I am loving it. I'm loving it. 99, 99. And while we're waiting for one more person, because I reckon we'll get, we can do it, right? Let me show you the video you may have missed. You know, I mention Meet Kevin a lot. I do it not to put the guy down. He, he works very hard. He deserves what he gets. However, he does make up stories just to promote himself. He really does. I proved it yesterday. There it is. Proof. He told me, we spoke together in a live chat. I got the I got the the chat and I shared it with you in this video. And he and he said it's easier to sell um it's easier to sell positive news. Even though I proved everything he sells is negative. And he does it to help people apparently. It's easier to sell positive news, but I never do. Okay. Go and check that video out. You'll be quite surprised about what, the way he explains it to me. 99, we're going to wrap this video up. Have we done it? Have we got a suggested video on YouTube two weeks ahead of schedule? Three, two, one. <laughs> yes, we have. Yes, we have. Stick that in your pipe, roaring kitty, with a million people waiting for your stream. They wasn't waiting two weeks before the event, were they? No. 105, two weeks before the event. Lucas Aids, join my army. Let's set the world ablaze. People want what's real. They don't give up their hard time. Their, their time is the only commodity that's of any value that you have. They don't give up their time to sit and watch you make videos so you make money. They join you for two reasons. One, it makes them feel good whether it's entertainment or support or whatever, that's great. That's one reason. The other reason is they get the information of what they came for. They get to know what's actually going on, not the creator's version of it, just so it benefits that person. You're not all clones queuing, queuing up to watch me talk nonsense so I make money and you sit there and lose it. What's the sense of that? A load of rubbish. There we go. Click above my head for all the links. Down below in the description for the event. The event, uh, you, I'll share with you the Meet Kevin video. I will share with you th the information we posted yesterday all about NVIDIA. And I, and I showed you all the latest information uh, uh, about uh, what uh, was going on. I put it out late last night. It went out about 10 o'clock last night. Most of you missed it. There is the video there. It's BS subpoena. It's already had 5,000 uh, views. It, w it went out literally 10 o'clock last night. It's been out 12 hours. Go and check that. Uh, you need to see it. I told you everything that was going to be okay. And guess what? Today it's okay. Can I, uh, have I got a, a, a magic? Is it magic? No, it's just reading the numbers. There you go. That's it from me. Over here, I shall put um, the uh, event. Join us for the biggest event in the history of the world ever, <laughs> the FOMC uh, NVIDIA Day. And down here, I shall put um, the, the, the NVIDIA playlist and you'll go and see, uh, Sandy did a great chart down there. And also you can go and see the BS subpoena. Whoa! David Hensley donated $2 through a super chat. Congrats on the 100 like Martin. Yeah, that's it. Thank you very much. And uh, till next time, 100, you're having a laugh, aren't you? It's 105. Take care of yourselves and each other. Go LucasAids!